<laughs> hey there, girls and boys, space space friends and family, in laws, outlaws, past, present, future tense customers of Ideal Electric, everybody on the line, all yous on the used tube. Figured I'd make a quick video because something awesome happened today. I just got home from work and my wife said, I need you to see something. <clears throat> I said, Yay, my boots came. She said, Nope, those aren't boots. I said, yeah, those are my boots. I ordered them. They got the name on the thing. It's what I, those are my boots. She said, nope, not boots. Clearly they're not boots. I'm like, what are you talking about, woman? They clearly say brunt on the box. I ordered brunt boots. They're the best. She said, nope. It says right there, this is not a shoe box. It's a tool box. Well, I can't argue with that. I don't know. People ask me all the time, they see my Brunt boots, and they ask me if I like them. And I've had a couple pair now, and, I, you know, I don't get no money from Brunt. This ain't no kind of paid advertising or anything like that. Um, well, help me understand why I can't get this thing open. But I will say I've had a couple of pair of Brunt boots. They're super comfortable. They've held up really well. And I've been very pleased. I normally get the um, unlined because I don't have any problems with my feet being cold. My feet will sweat if, they, if I get lined boots and then they get cold. So I get these unlined, um, I think they're the 8 inch. Are they, uh, let's see. Marin unlined comp. Six inch comp to brown. I wanted the blacks, but I don't think they got the blacks in the comp. They just had them in the regular soft toe. And the toe box in these is super comfortable. So I'd much rather have the protection since the toe box is so comfortable. But man, those are good looking boots. And you order them for if you got wide feet like I do, they just have an extra pair of insoles you take out. They, uh, the soles hold up. I'm wearing a pair right now that I've had these for, uh, I think we figured out the other day, nine months. And I've worked in them every day for nine months. And they still got some tread. They're getting a little, you know, they're not as, as aggressive as new. But they're not that worn either. And they're still waterproof. Of course, I put the boot conditioner on them when I got them. And one time since then. And, um... You know, the toes are a little wore out from being stooped down doing stuff. They're not bad. And they actually have a boot that has like a heavy cap over that. But, uh, man, I have been so very pleased with these Brunt boots. So, if you're wondering if they're, they're actually cheaper than a lot of competitors do. And they're made in the good old U.S. of A., I ain't seen made in China or Taiwan or Korea or anything like that on them anywhere. So that's a bonus. You know, buy American. Made in America by Americans. So if that means anything to you, these are EH rated. I do electrical work, as many of you know. And uh, so there's my, there's my spiel for Brunt Boots. Go get you a pair. I've had these, a couple pairs of these, and I've also had the ones that, uh, the black comp toe that look kind of like a sneaker. I wore those at work for about a year, and I've loved both of them. I'm gonna get me a black pair. Brun, I wish you had a black pair with a comp toe. I think you did, and I didn't order them, and they're probably sold out. But, um, you know, gotta have that comp toe so I can, everybody step on my feet all day, it don't hurt. No, really, you know why. You know why. Safety third. That's why. <laughs>